Tesla's mission has always been simple but bold. Deliver the most affordable electric cars to customers as fast as possible. And now, the company is finally pushing that mission to the next level. This is the latest confirmed design direction for the Tesla Model 2, a car expected to launch as early as the first quarter of 2026. For months, the internet has been flooded with speculation. We've seen at least five different prototype designs circulating everywhere, each claiming to be the true Model 2. The flood of rumors led to confusion, skepticism, and even accusations that Tesla was misleading the public. That's why Elon Musk finally addressed the situation head-on during Tesla's annual shareholder meeting, and what he revealed drastically changed everything we thought we knew. Elon promised that the upcoming product demo will be nothing short of unforgettable. And this time he wasn't exaggerating. The first truth to accept is that the Model 2 is not some entirely new vehicle built from scratch. Instead, it's Tesla's most minimalist car ever, intentionally simplified in both design and features. But don't mistake that simplicity for weakness. Tesla insists that the Model 2 will still deliver the familiar driving feel of the Model 3 and Model Y, with even a subtle hint of the Model S. The goal here is accessibility. Tesla is removing unnecessary components and rarely used features in order to bring the price down dramatically, all while keeping safety, range, and the Tesla driving experience intact. Tesla confirmed that the Model 2 will arrive in two variants, a base version starting at an incredible $15,990 and a premium long-range model expected to land around $30,000. And here's the shocking part. Both versions are expected to include full self-driving FSD completely free instead of the current $10,000 price tag. So now the question becomes, what does the first official look at the Model 2 really tell us? What's different between the standard and long-range versions? And how is Tesla planning to build a sub-$16,000 EV at massive scale? The Model 2 was widely rumored to be canceled, but it has now been fully revived. Tesla fans can finally take a deep breath. This affordable Tesla is very real. Unlike the RoboTaxi, the Model 2 is designed for everyday drivers, and it's being developed with a brand new hybrid production strategy that combines two major manufacturing approaches. This innovation could push the price even lower than $15,990, depending on battery costs and volume scaling. According to Tesla, they're now accelerating development so aggressively that customers may begin receiving their cars in the first quarter of 2026. For the first time ever, Tesla also confirmed that the Model 2 and the RoboTaxi are the two major upcoming vehicles currently in development, meaning the Model 2 is absolutely not canceled. Tesla's VP of Vehicle Engineering confirmed that the new affordable EVs will use elements from Tesla's existing platforms and will be built on current production lines. This means the Model 2 will not require a brand new factory or an entirely new assembly system. It's a redesigned, streamlined re-engineering of Tesla's proven platforms, optimized specifically for cost reduction and mass production. Many people argue that this move is coming too late. If Tesla had launched this EV sooner, Millions more would already be driving electric today. But the timing still matters. The average new car in the U.S. costs nearly $50,000. The average EV costs more than $57,000. Even though prices have dropped since 2023, EVs remain too expensive for most families. That's exactly why the Model 2 exists. Inside, the Model 2 follows Tesla's new minimalist philosophy. It features an open center console, inspired by the Cybertruck, fabric covered door panels, a redesigned dash, and mostly manual interior adjustments to save cost. The driver's seat offers 10 way power adjustment, while the passenger seat includes 4 way power adjustment, both controlled through the touchscreen. 
The car includes a seven-speaker audio system, automatic headlights, two-tone fabric seats with vegan leather accents, and a sealed glass roof with improved insulation. Most interior systems have been simplified. No HEPA filter, manual mirror adjustments, no rear screen, and no powered folding mirrors. Tesla focused on essentials that matter for everyday driving, not luxury extras that inflate costs. The Model 2 long-range version, expected around $30,000, shares most hardware with the standard model, but offers a 53-kilowatt-hour battery, 321 miles of estimated range, 310 horsepower, and a 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration time of 5.8 seconds. The vehicle includes a front bumper camera with a washer, sound-insulated front doors, and a panoramic glass roof. The 15.4-inch touchscreen remains the main control hub. Charging speed remains 225 kilowatts, delivering up to 170 miles of range in just 15 minutes. Both models come in the same three color options, stealth gray, pearl white, and diamond black. Tesla's strategy makes sense. Focus on range, charging speed, safety, and software, not luxury materials. These updated versions of the Model 2 are designed to attract first-time EV buyers who want something reliable, affordable, and technologically ahead of the competition. In reality, the Model 2 is shaping up to be the most accessible Tesla ever made. The big question now is, how can Tesla build a Model 2 every 10 seconds? The answer lies in the revolutionary unboxed production process. When Tesla first introduced this system at Investor Day 2023, the industry was stunned. It promised to cut production costs by 50%, reduce factory space by 40%, simplify assembly, and drastically increase output. Using single-piece gigacastings, modular subassembly, and structural battery packs, Tesla intended to build future EVs like snap-together Lego blocks instead of traditional step-by-step -step assembly lines. The $1,000 next-generation motor was another breakthrough. It uses no rare-earth materials, has 75% less silicon carbide, is twice as production-efficient, and is dramatically cheaper and smaller than the current Model Y motor. But the unboxed process, like any bold innovation, came with risk. During testing, Tesla encountered challenges with robotic integration, calibration delays, and system reliability at scale. The method relies heavily on automation and requires far fewer human workers, making early-stage debugging even more complex. So Tesla pivoted. Instead of relying entirely on the unboxed line for the Model 2, the company decided to merge parts of the new system with traditional Model 3 and Model Y assembly lines. This hybrid approach reduces risk and accelerates production while still enabling cost reductions. Critics feared that this shift meant the Model 2 would become a stripped-down mini Model 3 with reduced features. But Tesla clarified that the new platform will still incorporate select elements of the unboxed process, along with innovations like the next-generation motor. Tesla's internal decision reflects a balance between visionary technology and real-world practicality. The company aims to ramp up production efficiently without risking delays or quality issues. Tesla also recently reduced its global workforce by over 10%, or around 14,000 employees. This strategic downsizing is part of a larger push to streamline operations, increase automation, and speed up new platform development. Meanwhile, Tesla will still use the full unboxed manufacturing method for the RoboTaxi, now officially rebranded as the CyberCab. This confirms that Tesla hasn't abandoned the unboxed system. They're simply applying it selectively where it makes the most sense. In the end, Tesla's hybrid manufacturing approach preserves innovation while maintaining stability during a challenging market period. The Model 2 will still benefit from next-gen ideas and cost-saving breakthroughs, just not in the fully radical way originally planned.
This strategy gives Tesla the flexibility to scale production, control costs, reassure investors, and meet demand for affordable EVs at a time when the industry is shifting rapidly. AS Tesla pushes forward with the Model 2. One of the most important factors shaping its success will be the global battery supply chain. Over the past year, Tesla has quietly secured several new lithium, nickel, and phosphate supply agreements, signaling that they're preparing for a massive increase in low-cost EV production. The Model 2 is expected to rely heavily on LFP batteries for the base model, a chemistry that is safer, cheaper, and more durable. While LFP packs don't offer the same energy density as nickel-based batteries, they're ideal for a budget EV focused on longevity and affordability. Tesla's decision to scale LFB for the Model 2 marks a strategic shift toward democratizing electric mobility, especially for markets like Asia, Europe, and Latin America, where price sensitivity is high. Tesla is preparing to assemble the Model 2 in factories across China, Mexico, and potentially Germany. This multi-factory production strategy dramatically reduces logistics costs and import fees, helping Tesla maintain the $15,990 price while improving delivery times. The company's Gigafactory in Mexico, one of the most anticipated EV factories in years, is expected to play a central role in producing the Model 2 for North and South America. With lower labor costs and streamlined cross-border transport routes, Mexico could become Tesla's most important production hub for affordable EVs. Tesla is also betting heavily on the idea that software will matter more than hardware for the next generation of vehicles. Even though the Model 2 cuts back on some physical features, Tesla is doubling down on software-first innovation. Over-the-air updates will continuously improve efficiency, charging curves, and autopilot capability. The inclusion of free FSD transforms the Model 2 from a low-cost EV into a long-term autonomous platform that becomes smarter each year. This means even the cheapest Tesla will eventually gain features that many $80,000 luxury cars still can't deliver. For buyers, this eliminates the fear of their car becoming outdated. The Model 2 is designed to evolve over time. In addition, Tesla is preparing a new generation of digital services built around the Model 2. This includes upgraded cabin gaming, a redesigned Tesla arcade interface, and improved connectivity features intended to entertain passengers during charging sessions. While the Model 2's interior is more minimalistic, Tesla believes that smart software can deliver more value than physical features. The company is also exploring subscription bundles for premium connectivity, FSD add-ons, enhanced safety features, and entertainment services. These recurring revenue streams will help Tesla keep the upfront price of the car low while offering optional upgrades for customers who want more customization. From a market perspective, the arrival of the Model 2 is expected to disrupt the global automotive industry in the same way the original Model 3 did back in 2017 Tesla's hybrid production approach and $1,000 next-gen motor give them a cost advantage that legacy automakers simply can't match. Industry analysts predict that once the Model 2 begins mass production, several competing EVs in the $25,000 to $35,000 range will be forced to slash prices to remain competitive. This could trigger a new price war that reshapes the EV landscape worldwide, and Tesla is positioned to lead it. With a price low enough to reach millions of new drivers, including students, first-time car owners, fleet operators, and rideshare drivers, Tesla is entering a new era of mass adoption. The company's long-term vision has always been to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. The Model 2 is the car that makes that vision achievable at scale. For the first time, an electric vehicle with next-generation technology, fast charging, and full autonomy capabilities will be priced within reach of ordinary families. If Tesla delivers on even half of what they've promised, 
The automotive world is about to change forever. Beyond the product itself, Tesla is also preparing for the massive service and charging demands that will come with millions of new Model 2 owners. The company has already begun expanding its global supercharger footprint with a focus on high-density urban areas and long-distance travel routes. With the supercharger network now open to other EV brands, Tesla profits directly from every kilowatt sold, strengthening the financial foundation needed to support a low-margin vehicle like the Model 2. To handle increased demand, Tesla is rolling out next-generation V4 superchargers capable of supporting higher voltages and faster charging speeds. This infrastructure gives the Model 2 an advantage no other affordable EV can match, a charging experience already proven, reliable, and accessible worldwide. Another critical factor is durability. Tesla knows that an affordable EV must be extremely reliable to earn customer trust, especially in markets where maintenance costs can make or break a vehicle's success. That's why the Model 2 is being engineered with fewer moving parts, simplified electronics, and a reduced number of failure points. Manual adjustments, simplified interiors, and modular components aren't just cost-saving decisions. They're reliability decisions. Tesla wants this vehicle to last 300,000 to 500,000 miles with minimal maintenance, even for owners who may not have access to service centers. This long-term durability strategy is essential for Tesla's plan to dominate emerging markets, where reliability and low running costs carry more weight than luxury features. Tesla's focus on autonomy also reveals another layer of strategy behind the Model 2. As FSD improves, this vehicle could eventually serve multiple purposes. A personal car, a shared mobility vehicle, or even part of a future autonomous fleet. Elon Musk has repeatedly stated that the value of a Tesla increases dramatically once it can drive itself. And by including FSD at no extra cost, Tesla is essentially future-proofing the Model 2. If Tesla succeeds in solving autonomy at scale, the Model 2 could become the most profitable vehicle in the company's history, not from its sale price, but from its ability to operate as a robotaxi, rental car, or digital service platform. Finally, the launch of the Model 2 represents a symbolic turning point for Tesla. For years, the company has been associated with premium performance EVs, advanced tech, and futuristic designs. But the Model 2 shifts the narrative entirely. It's no longer about competing with luxury brands, it's about making electric mobility mainstream and accessible for middle-class families across the globe. This is the beginning of Tesla's next chapter, a mass-market expansion built on affordability, scale, and global reach. And now the big question remains. Which version will you choose when the Model 2 officially goes on sale, the ultra-affordable $15,990 standard version or the premium long-range model? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for the next massive Tesla update dropping in just two days. If you want more exciting content about Tesla EVs or Tesla Bot, hit like, share the video, and turn on notifications. Your support means everything, and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.